Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have this natural, minimal makeup look for you, so let's get started. Starting off fresh faced, I'm going in with the Professional Primer. I'm just using this in like targeted areas, so where I do have the pores showing. This will just like help the other makeup go on better and stay on a little bit longer as well. Then I'm going in with the Hello Flawless Oil Free Oxygen Wow Foundation by Benefit. And I'm taking it on my fingers and then I'm going to blend it in with a stippling brush. I just find that this gives a really natural effect. And I'm going to go in with a little bit more just for a bit of extra coverage. I'm just so used to my full coverage foundation that I needed a little bit more on this day. But I still feel like it looks natural and it does match my tan that I have on as well. Then going in with some concealer. This is the Neutrogena Brightening Eye Concealer. And I'm just taking it underneath my eyes to brighten that area up. I'm also going to take it on my nose, my chin, and I'm going to take it around the edges of my nose. So this is going to cover the dark circles, brighten up that area, and conceal a little bit of redness on my nose and my cheeks as well. I'm blending it out with my finger, which I feel like it's the most natural finish that you get with concealer. So yeah. Next up, I'm gonna use a cream contour, which I will confess, this was pretty much my second time using cream contouring products. So I wasn't that great at it, but it gave me what I needed. I just needed a little bit more depth around the edges of my face and in my cheekbones as well. So I'm just dobbing some bits on and then blending it out with a brush. Now I am going to set that under eye area because otherwise it would move on me and my oily skin. And then I decided I wanted to set the rest of my face. So I take a bigger brush and set the rest of my face as well. Just so things don't move during the day. <laughs> Now for brows, I'm taking the Maybelline Brow Drama, and this product is super, super quick and easy to use. It's just a brow pomade pencil, and I'm just drawing it on and then brushing it out, and then I'm gonna fix it up with my fingers and brush it in and add a little bit more till I'm happy with the result. Next up, an eye base. I'm using this Maybelline Color Tattoo and just taking it on my eyelids. This will keep them from creasing and it gives a little bit of sheen to it as well. I'm going in with a really, really natural blush. I do obviously have quite flushed cheeks normally. Now with the mascara, I am taking pretty much a dried up mascara and I'm blinking my lashes into the mascara. I have quite fair lashes naturally and I have quite long lashes as well. I really like this technique because it looks quite natural and it highlights all of my lashes as well. Then I'm taking, this is actually like a dirty crease brush. Well, it's not dirty, I used it once. And it has a little bit of color left in it. And I'm just running that through the crease just for some depth in the eyes. And now for lips, I'm using this color which is basically your lips but better. Well, my lips but better by Maybelline. And then I'm going to line the outline with this lip liner as well, which pretty much matches it. it might be a little bit deeper. Um, just to define my lips a little bit more. Next up, I'm going in with this highlight. Now this highlight is so natural. Like it's so natural you can't even tell that you have it on. So I'm just taking that on the tops of my cheekbones and my nose, Cupid's bow, and yeah. Then we are just about done. So this is the completed look. I hope you guys liked this really natural, minimal makeup look. Let me know if you'd love to see more looks like this. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.